I think it was in this direction, somewhat. <laughs> the find it. Let's see. So there was this creep find. There was that creep find. Am I? Hmm. I think it's this way, past the creep find. There was a passage in between. And seeing as we have no compass, no minimap. Oh, great. Alright, it should be somewhere around here. Let's see, how far are we? Oh no, not yet. That's still 200 meters further. But we're vaguely in the right zone. Lots of uh, salvage here. Can I s Oh. Oh, and... Oh crap, some titanium that I can't use. There's something here too. Inventory full. I just want the blueprint. Damn it. I probably already had the blueprint. That's why it's, why it's given me titanium. Now, where is my base? I'm just gonna follow this passage in between the creep vine. Eventually, we should find it. Oh, there it is. Now the thing is, how the hell am I going to connect this air pump all the way down there? I guess I'll have to start at the bottom to make sure that I like properly align this thing. Because if I dump it over here, I might be way off. Like it's probably right here, but you don't know for sure. So I'll start at the base. I don't know if I'll need to connect it with this thing, or just inside the... Oh, okay, so... I guess I do. And it seems to be going in any direction it wants to. Okay, this is interesting. Okay, that actually makes things rather easy. I wonder if it just floats. Is, is it gonna fall down? Once I... 30 seconds. Is it gonna stay there? Okay, good. Well, oh shit, there. Alright, it'll work. It's not gonna look pretty, but it'll work. And we'll need many, many more of these pipes. I'm actually thinking Oxygen. all these pipes together, they're gonna require three times the amount of titanium that I used for my little base. Oh, can I stretch it this long? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Looks like this one is only that far, but this one, I seem to be able to stretch all the way up here. Oh yeah, okay, good. Well, that's good to know. <laughs> Glad I uh, redid that part. 30 seconds. So we might have enough pipes. They seem to stretch for about 5 meters perhaps, maybe even more. Right, let's get some air. Okay. We're good. So we made way too many pipes. Oxygen. But better safe than sorry, I suppose. I'm gonna need them eventually. Again. reached the surface but this one doesn't seem to be able to reach the surface so how far do we go with this 
I guess I first have to put down the other one and then try and connect them. The floating air pump. Otherwise it's gonna be a mess. Place it somewhere down here. Did we put it down? Come on, put it down. Okay, maybe not. Guess I'll have to hook it up to the end of this pipe. So let's bring it up around here somewhere. And I'll put this thing on top. There. Okay, that didn't work. How do I? This has to go over here somewhere. It is a floating air pump. Oh, oh, finally. Okay, he dumped it. That was quite an ordeal. Alright, now we should be able to connect them. It is making noise though. Um, okay. Let's try this. Is it connecting? Why are you not connecting? Are you telling me that I'm gonna have to do this from top to bottom instead of bottom to top? think I do. I can't seem to connect them. They don't want to... Damn it. I don't have any water with me. Um, that's not good. Caution. Mild dehydration detected. Yes, let's see if I can find a bladder fish. And this thing looks ugly as hell, but... <laughs> Uh, let's see. Let's go back. Is that a bladder fish? No, it's something entirely different. Oh, that's one. I think eating them raw gives me some water. Uh, bladder fish. No, don't. Just grab it. What do I get from eating it? Minus water. Okay, so that's not good. I'm gonna grab a few. Okay, that's good. Now quickly get back to the base. Oh, I did get a waypoint for it. Now where the hell is... Oh no, I didn't. Alright, never mind. I'm a little bit confused. I just have to hurry back so that I don't dehydrate. Oh, okay, there's another lifeboat there. I'm gonna check that one out. Lifeboat number three. I think one of these fish tried to eat me. Okay, so how the hell do I connect those properly? Okay, we're good. Okay. That was actually rather close. I don't know how quickly you die if you're dehydrated. But I don't intend to find out. If we do find out, it'll be by accident. And I'm hoping you can't hear too much noise. Seems like there's someone in one of the apartments below drilling some holes in the wall or something. Vital signs stabilizing. Luckily this game is rather noisy, so it might be uh, not that easy to hear. Uh, so, I'm gonna try and grab a few more bladder fish, because if I wanna go out there, I wanna have some provisions so that I don't need to come back here uh, this often. Food isn't an issue. I think uh, food goes drains a lot slower than water does, and despite the fact that we're in an ocean, we got nothing to drink. Okay, there 
should be so okay there's one okay they are very slow so easy to catch I'm very sure that I'm probably building my base in completely the wrong way, but <laughs> it's gonna get built eventually. You know what? This is a game of exploration uh, compared to other games, for example. This one is very interesting to play if you don't know anything yet, because everything is new, everything looks very interesting. And, uh, well, that makes it interesting. <laughs> Difficult to explain. It's like, it would be boring to be an explorer if everything you get to explore, you've already seen. Oh, I, uh, I can pick up these things. I forgot about that, but I don't have anything to do. Uh, I can't build anything with them yet. Now, how many did I pick up? Rather fish? Four. Okay, that's not too bad. That should give me uh, three extra bottles of water to bring with me. Soon enough. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to put down a water filtration system in my little base. I probably won't have the space for it, and I probably can't even build that thing yet. Uh, let's see. Blueprints. Oh. 33%. Uh, well, it doesn't matter that much. That's Cyclops. I'm very far away from actually building that. That's the uh, big submarine. I don't even have a... the sea mod yet. A small submarine. Let's see. Does it actually show what I need to build? Because it shows the Cyclops, uh, the Sea Moth. Oh no, wait. I'm apparently able to build these things if I had the necessary machinery, but I don't. The prawn suit is going to be interesting. It's some sort of a power armor type of thing, but. Actually, no, it's somewhere between a power armor and a small submarine. Don't know exactly how it works. We'll find out eventually. Uh, so... What was I even trying to check? I don't know. Something. Beacon. Ah. That's what I need to make a waypoint. I'm gonna try and make it. Of course, I'm gonna need to get some copper for the wiring. What do we need for the wiring? Copper wire. Wiring kit, silver ore. Crap, what was it? Copper wire or wiring kit? Copper wire. Luckily, I have two copper ore. I hope it was only two and not three. Good. How much space is this thing going to pick up? Take, oh, only one tile. Okay, that's good. Uh, we have lots of these pipes that I probably don't need anymore. Not yet. What else do I need? Yeah, so I'm thinking I'm going to have to start with the floating air pump and then connect it to the base. So, starting from the ocean from the surface and then going down. I guess that makes sense. I think the other air pump is for like pumping air in between compartments. Alright, fair enough. So do I have everything I need? I have some food. I have apparently a peeper. Let's uh, eat it before it goes... Oh no wait. It's a raw peeper. Last thing is, as long as you don't cook them, they stay good. Alright. So that's that. That's that. 
I probably will need a bunch of extra titanium though. So I don't have any here. Eventually once I get some... I'm just thinking. I hope that I can make those... What is it again? Uh, wall lockers. Oh crap, it's empty. Let's try this. Okay, good. Got some here. Let's dump a few of these pipes. Well, I guess... I don't have that much left, do I? I thought I had more titanium. All copper. I guess I don't. Too many damn lockers. Well, I guess I don't. It's gonna have to suffice. What do I need for the solar panel? Quartz titanium. It's gonna have to do. Alright, now let's find where my base is. Then we'll get to put down the beacon, and then we don't have to search for it anymore. Luckily he's very occupied with the salvage, that's good. Um, you could actually get him to bring salvage to you if you catch a peeper and feed it to them. I don't know exactly how you feed it to them, apart from maybe releasing the fish in their vicinity. Oh yeah, and there was the other pod, pod number three, was out here somewhere. Must be rather close by because I went through the creepvine cluster. Oh shit, this isn't a good place to be. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Not over there. We'll uh, search for it once the base is finished. Not well, finished, I mean, once we get some air flowing and maybe some power. But I'm not too sure about that one. Now I can put down a solar panel there. It's not going to be efficient, but it's going to give us a little bit of power. So it may be better than nothing at all. I just have to figure out how to make this damn thing work. So I'm going to have to go... Yes, from top to bottom. So let's dump you here. Come on. Why, why are you not doing it? Okay. Oh, I seem to need to... Okay. I need to release it from below the surface. Alright. Now, let's try this again. connecting to the wrong one. Alright, so I'm just gonna get rid of these then. Well, it's a little bit more difficult to try and... Yeah, okay, I gotta get rid of all of them. How much room do I have? Not much. Right, let's start with one. And it seems to be more difficult to do this properly. This way, I'm probably gonna be way off. Good. Let's try and go somewhere around here, maybe. Oh shit, air. Oxygen. Alright, I think we're halfway.
close. Let's get rid of this one. I don't know if it'll connect to that pump or if it'll just connect to the base itself. We'll see soon enough. 30 seconds. I might need to deconstruct this thing. Okay, let's get some air first. I think two more pipes will do. <laughs> Just look at it, it's absolutely awful. Oxygen. All right, and it seems to work without any power. Is that like where I need to connect it? It seems to show something. Please connect. Do I just go like this? Do we now have air? Warning, emergency power only. Oxygen production offline. Okay, well. We seem to be getting air, but it's still filled with water, so how the hell do I get that out? So we're pumping air into the compartment. How the hell do we get... Oh, yeah, let's put down the beacon in the meantime. Somewhere. Around here? Can I put it underwater? Or does it float? I guess it floats, yeah. Well, okay. Back here is fine. Um, so, what am I missing? Probably a whole lot. Well, it doesn't have power, so let's start with making a solar panel. A very crappy one, but it might work. It should work. Let's build one on top of this module. Hope that actually works. Okay, good. Uh, it doesn't really matter how you place them, I think. Uh, let's put one there. That should give us some power. Not much, but... Okay. Looks like we're powered up. Do we have anything? Oh! So did I even need this thing? <laughs> what is it doing? You know what? I'm gonna find out. I'm going to get rid of this pipe. And we'll see if all the... Oxygen is gone or not. No, we still have oxygen, so all this thing needs is power, and it, uh, okay, well that's good. So, why do I need these pumps? There's probably a very good reason for it, but... I don't know what, but, yeah, okay, finally, we have a little base that we can use for all sorts of stuff. So, let's see. What sort of stuff would that be? Um, and apparently, the little power that is being granted to me by this solar panel is enough. It's at 90%. Sun so is setting. Oh, that's not good. Since I have a solar panel. I wonder if this thing is going to have enough power during the night. I might need to make some sort of battery. I don't know if that's possible. Not at this point at least. I can build another solar panel on top. Uh, let's see. How much quartz... Uh, how much... Titanium do I have? Three. And a ton of pipes. I wonder if I can deconstruct these. I don't think so. Um, you know, instead of making a other solar panel, I'm gonna construct... A wall locker. 
or regular docker? Which one's better? Quartz glass. Let's see how big they are. This one is... Probably bigger, but... I'm thinking that the wall locker is going to be a bit more efficient here, since we don't have a lot of space. So let's put a locker right here to start with. And that'll allow us to dump at least all these pipes. And here... Oh, it is pretty big. Wow, okay. We'll be able to do quite a bit of uh, resource harvesting. Let's dump it all in here. Well, all the resources anyway. Gas pot, sure. Uh, let's dump one of these, one of these, one of these, a bit of everything. Good. So, the base <laughs> has been finished. <clears throat> well, not finished. It's working. It's operational. And that's important. So now what we need is... Uh, I guess a, a fabricator there would be good, so that I can do some uh, resource production locally. What do we need for that anyway? Wiring kit, computer chip, titanium. I don't know if I have the necessary resources back there. I guess I'll grab a bunch on the way there. We might also be able to find a life pot number three. I'm just going to need to find a way to recharge these things. Now I can make new batteries to put into it. If it's ever is completely drained, but I don't exactly know how. I think you need to press E or something to replace the batteries, but you can only do this once they're empty. There could also be a way to recharge them in a different way. So I think that's only for um, equipment that uses... Shit, go away. Oh, shit. For a bigger equipment that can be recharged. Let's grab you. Oh, okay, that didn't work. Okay, let's grab you instead. And you. Oh, some salvage. I guess I didn't find life pots. Tree. We'll find it eventually. You know, those solar panels are actually very cheap. I could build quite a few on my little base to supply it with power. I can always deconstruct it. I just don't know if I can get all the materials back if I do. Probably not. Okay, I'm looking for some more salvage. Too. Although I have so many medkits already. Uh, damn, I always go for food here because this looks like a piece of cheese. What is it even? I don't even know what it is. It's like. Nothing in here even looks like this. So that's that. 
What else do we need for the fabricator? A wiring kit that requires silver. That I know because we've had to search like an hour for another piece of silver to make the first one for the rebreather, I think. Alright, and what else? A computer chip. Oh, right, that thing. Do I have some of those? I do. I think it's these ones. I'm gonna need gold too. I have that. Good. Should be able to make a chip. Ah, damn it, copper wire. Okay, we should have some copper, plenty of copper, in one of these chests. So now we have enough for the fabricator. We're also gonna need... Mm, well, more wall lockers would be good. I'm not sure if I'm gonna have space for an aquarium in that little... building. Maybe... Uh, I'll uh, get a bunch of glass and check it out. Uh, let's see, we're gonna need more solar panels. Some more quartz as well. Hmm... See, so I think the integrity, hull integrity, or whatever it is, starts at 8 base. Foundation gives me plus 2, which is 10, and this is minus 3, so we still have 7 left. So potentially we could still add in 7 of these somewhere. We'll do that eventually, but for now I'm gonna have to try and... Uh, Gather more resources, put down more of those wall lockers everywhere. And uh, let's get some more quartz. I should have more quartz somewhere. Uh, let's see, how much space do I have? Enough. I'm gonna see if I have some more line in one of these chests. Nope. Nope, some gold though. Don't need that. Nope, that's pipes. Ah, there we go. I knew I had a bunch. I don't need any lithium yet. Copper ore, I don't need that. Uh, I'm gonna bring whatever I can. I'm just gonna store it in the new wall locker that I'm gonna build there. What do we have here? More quartz, that's good. I'm uh, gonna need to refine a few of the those in glass. Possibly. That's lead. Alright, let's make a bit of glass. How much do we even need? Let's see. Solar panels quartz. I wonder, is there a way to make a battery of some sort to store power? Maybe the compartment comes with power storage on its own, somewhat. Bio reactor. Oh, uh, we can actually make this. All we need is uh, some lubricants and organic matter. This thing is probably huge. So we'll need to gather some creep vine, but we're very close to creep vine over there, so that's not a problem. A ladder, don't need that. I don't need this yet either. So just a fabricator, a bunch of wall lockers, that's a good start. And maybe another hatch on the other side, although it's not really necessary. Right, let's make some glass, let's see, two pieces perhaps. Or just one. No, two. Actually, no. <laughs> I 
I don't want to waste all my cores. Although, you know what, screw it, it's easy to find. I can just go out anywhere. Right, that's that. So we have some titanium, quartz, glass, copper, uh, everything for the fabricator. Do we have anything here that we need? Let's bring a few of these to dump up there. This thing uh, seems good. Apparently, we're quite hungry. Alright, off we go. Back towards. And we got this thing too. I guess I might need to grab it with me, but not on this trip. Now, luckily, we have a beacon. And if I follow, if I go straight towards the beacon, I should stumble on top of a life pod, life pod number three. But I, well, I guess we can uh, check it out. I don't have a lot of inventory space, so if we find anything interesting. Might be able to scan some things, so let's put the scanner in here. Now if I do go straight for beacon one, I am gonna go through the creep vine. So that's not ideal. But you know what, those fish are probably not gonna be able to catch me. I hope. As long as I keep swimming, we should be good. Just as I say this. Still swimming, still not eaten, so I think we're good. Did I scan this thing before? I probably did. Oh, there it is. No, it's not that hard to find once you got a beacon. Thirty seconds. Yeah, we should be able to make it. And I guess I should get rid of this thing. But you know what? Uh, I don't have enough storage space for all those pipes yet. Oh, yeah, I need to build a hatch here to make it easier to get in. Oxygen. There we go. We're good. So, power... How do I see how much power my station has? Does it even say? There's like... No control panel anywhere. Does this thing say anything? I don't know why I need this. Oh well. Alright, uh, the fabricator, uh, where I'm gonna put this thing, maybe next to this locker. I don't have a lot of space, but it should suffice. There we go, that's that. I'm guessing that most of these walls are gonna be filled up with lockers, so that we can gather all sorts of crap. <laughs> Alright, another one of these. Okay, now let's dump... Oh no, I was gonna make another solar panel, I think. Although I, I'm not sure if I need to. Oh wait, of course. This is at the top. 50 out of 50 power. I'm an idiot. Oh well. Um, I don't know how quickly it'll regenerate, so... Well, you know what? I don't need that much power, do I? Let's just see what happens if I make... What do I even need to make? Nothing. Let's just dump my materials in here for now. That way I can go back and gather more stuff. Mm. I'm gonna make another locker. I think it's two of these and one of these. 
No, it's just two of these. Let's see if I'm right. Damn it. <laughs> Quartz. Alright, more storage space. You know what? Well, we're at it. It doesn't look like I positioned them correctly, but, well, <laughs> it is what it is. This one actually looks smaller than the other one. Where is it? Looks like something's off. It's like, at the bottom they seem to be almost at the same level, but back here? Not quite. Huh? Oh well, 